Hey y'all, it's Krista. Um, so, sorry it's been so long since I put out a video. So I thought I would do something really special today. Um, I am, I'm going to do um, all reflex and floral colors and I've got my black light behind me so when I bring you down for the close up, I'm gonna shut off the lights and turn on the black light so that we can all look at it together and be in all together. So let's, let's see what I'm doing, what colors I'm using. I'm using the golden fluorescent blue and the phosphorescent green. And I'm using the fluorescent red and the fluorescent green. And I'm using Amsterdam Reflex Orange and Amsterdam's Reflex Rose. And for once in my life, I'm not using any gold or any white. I'm using my Oxide Black. And everything's been mixed with mix. So we're gonna get this cup layered up and see what we pour out. I think I'm gonna start with the black. Just a little bit. I'll set that over here. And then I think I'm gonna use this phosphorescent green. It's kind of a whitish color, but um, man, does it glow a really cool green. Um, then I think I'll use the fluorescent green on top of that. And then I'll put the blue. And then I'll go into my pink. You know what, I think I'm gonna put black in before I do that. Not a lot, just a little. Then I'm gonna do, instead of doing pink, I think I'll do the fluorescent red. And then I'll do the pink, the reflex rose. And then I'll use the reflex orange. And then I think I'll use the phosphorescent green instead of adding black again. And then I'll do the blue on top of that and then I'll do the green. And then I'll put black. Use a little bit more that time because we're getting closer to the end of the cup. So whatever is going to come out first is going to kind of spread out this way anyways. And then um, I'll use the red again. And pink, the reflex rose. And then the reflex orange. And then I think I'm gonna end it with the phosphorescent green. All right, we've got a really full cup. I think I'm just gonna empty this. So I may I may not get cells, but that's not, that's kind of not the purpose of this. It's to, I'm wanting to see what happens because I'm doing all these with mix. So I'm gonna set my cups aside. And I will get my, set this aside. And I'm gonna water down my flow extender here because
because trust me, I hardly ever use black and this leftover will never get used. So it's better to just use it up. Okay. All right, we're gonna put this in the middle. I'm gonna put all of it so I can rinse my cup out. Okay, set that aside. I'm gonna give this a torch. Cells aren't always important. Sometimes the composition looks amazing without them. Okay, all right y'all, we're, we're doing this in the light and then we're gonna do it in the, then we're gonna close up in the dark. So, all right, let's go. Squeezing my cup in a little bit. I think I'm just gonna keep doing the twist. This is cool even in the daylight so far. Okay. Tilt my cup back and catch it. Awesome catch. That doesn't happen all the time. Look how cool this is. Cells, they pretty much don't exist. I'm gonna give this a torch. That's good. Whatever cells are in here, it's from me torching. It is definitely not because I'm using anything that is a cell creator. Okay. I'm gonna wipe my finger off. And then I think I'm gonna use up the rest of my colors as my edge colors. So we will Put blue up in this corner. Empty that cup out. I love empty cups, y'all. It is so awesome at the end of a pour to say my cup was empty. Because my leftovers are starting to get out of control. I think I'll put red down here. And empty this cup out. Okay. And then I think I'll put the orange up here. Or no, I think I'll put it down here. And empty this one. This is psychedelic, y'all. Super cool pour. Okay, set that aside. I'm gonna use the pink over here because there's already pink. There's not much left of it, so or the reflex rose, so just throw it down. Okay, I'm gonna scooch that up to the edge. Okay. And then I've got some green. That's all I have left. We'll spread that out. I 
can't wait to see this under a black light, y'all. It's going to be super cool. Bella's over here waiting for me to turn off the lights, too. All right, I've got my omelet turner. And we're going to spread this out. Scooch it right up to the edge. done. It's hard to see where it begins and ends. So much cool stuff going on. Bring this over here, get it right up to the edge. All right, let's scrape my omelet turner. Okay. Nope, I'm not gonna wreck it. We're just gonna stretch it out, y'all. All right, let's go. I'm just twirling it around. See what it wants to do. When I come back around it, I'm going to take it off of this corner over here. All right, now I'm going to bring it back. And then I'm going to take it off of this corner. And then I'm going to bring it back. And I'm going to set it down. I'm going to turn it around so y'all can see what I'm doing. All right. Back to tilting. I'm going to take it down over here. Bring it back again. And then we'll go off this corner. These lines are so crisp and the transparency in this is so amazing, y'all. You won't believe it. Okay, then bring it back. think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn you back around again because this is awesome so I think I'm going to just take it all down this way spread out this cool stuff going on up here I don't want to get all of that what looks like white off because that's the phosphors, phosphorescent green and that's going to be a really cool corner. All right. I just want to pull it back a little bit this way. And then I'm going to be done. Turn my corners. And 
sometimes you have to just walk away from a painting. I, I didn't put out a video last week because I scraped a canvas three times. And I know that I should show my failures too, but they were really bad, y'all. Which meant that I just wasn't in the right place to do a pour just then, so it was better to walk away. I needed to stop and smell the roses. I say that to one of the people that I, I kind of mentor should learn to take my own advice. All right, I'm gonna take my gloves off. I'm gonna turn this black light on. And because you're all seeing it right now in the light, we're all gonna see this together in the dark. Okay, I'm gonna turn this light on. And we'll come in for the close-up. All right, let me come get you. Y'all, my goodness. What? And look at that transparency in there under this black light. Wow. Look, we're all saying wow together. How cool is this piece? Look at right there. Wow. Look at these lines. The lines are so funky. Look here. Here we are. Viewing, wow. Viewing in the dark. All right, y'all. I hope this was worth the two week wait but I'm loving it. I hope you all have a wonderful day. And remember, never give up. You've always got a pour in you. All right, have a wonderful day, y'all. Bye.